RSL with an opportunity. Yes, side panel. Corey Baird and RSL takes the lead. RSL able to win that back. Here's Baird. Put it on that right foot. Yes, Corey Baird. Never going to slip me through. Baird's outside of mistakes for a point. Something in the beginning of the year I wasn't even really thinking about. I was just thinking like, let's get a few games with the first team, let's try and contribute as much as possible. And the year has really taken off in a way I never expected, never could have seen coming. So the consistent playing time, it, it really shows the confidence they've had in me and the trust they've had in me. So that's just given me in the back of my head that, that confidence that this is where I belong, this is where I should be. I think the club does a great job integrating new guys, and I think you've seen it with Natum recently. I think having two games back to back in such a quick succession, I don't really have time to think about it. I mean, all, all of our thoughts are on sporting on Sunday, just getting our mind right for that, and taking care of our bodies. I'm ready, look. Come on, Caparelli. guy in front of me yeah, jump to, and to, yeah to and then I was thinking don't touch the ball please, please yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah karate kid here karate kid come on handball handball yes. <laughs> yeah yeah With foot, you have to do his foot. Yeah. Hey, Justin, it cannot be better. Oh, that's good, yeah. Hey, the mood is good, huh? That's good. I love it. Wow! Well done, Adam. Good piece. Well done. Yeah, yeah. We have to be tired, you know, because I mean, they didn't play one ball between us. Albert! Right from the start, that whistle blows, we're ready to go. To the box, if they're not playing it short, you're looking to drop back quickly. If they're playing short, then you can step up. On paper, which everybody talks about, we shouldn't be here on paper, all right? We're not a big spending club. You have to believe in yourself, okay? I'm proud of you guys for Thursday's performance and result. But 90 minutes out of 180 minutes, which starts tonight, okay? This is the first half tonight. Come on! Lays it off for Shallowy, cut back, Shelton, and shot, big save Romano, and he'll cover it up. Marcel one with a short corner. Driven low and wide of Tim Melia. Goal kick, sporting Kansas City. Here is Zussi, playing it across, Shallowy. Ran into a dangerous spot, and it's gonna be ruled a goal kick. Back it comes for Sonny. Spinning, Severino, stopped easily by Melia. There is no rebound. And here they come. Felipe Gutierrez, five in the attack now offensively for Sporting Kansas City. Gutierrez fires it! Tipped by Raimondo for a corner. Unable to turn, that one's blocked. Zussi's after it. Zussi got it forward to Shelton and then he got taken out. Whoop. Yellow card. Rusnak, he was one of the players in yellow card jeopardy. Guess who's missing the second leg? Aye, aye, aye. The most concerning thing for me, not just our movement slow, but the ball movement is so slow, guys. Nikki had the most touches in that half for us. Everything's backwards because the off-ball movement. Here's what I want to do second half, okay? Kyle, start with you, but it could be sunny at times. When we have the ball from Nikki or in the back, I want you dropping back between the center backs, okay? 
which means that Brooks and Aaron have to take a higher position, which means that Sonny, yeah. if Kyle's dropping, you can't come here, you can't go there, because that leaves this open, okay? The movement has to be better. Ball movement and the player movement. Come on, we're good, come on. Come on, boys. of Sporting Kansas City, and now outside, it goes to Rustak. Off Cranach, Rustak goes, goal! What a goal! Oh, so it's Well, that's given away. Sporting with a chance. Driven in. It's tied. A mistake by RSL has resulted in this goal. Was that his first touch? Bad time for a giveaway. Bad place. 1-1. Delivered into the box. Romano came out. He got taken out. Zussi fires. That's blocked. Another shot blocked. It was Espinosa that time. A man down for RSL in the box. Sabarino in the box. Slipping around, plays it across. Second ball is coming down outside of the box. And will roll out for a throw in. That was dangerous. Herrera. Herrera drives it. Melia. No rebound there. Driven to the middle. Cleared away. Not out of danger. Played in. Oh. Saved by Melia. Looked like it was deflected off a sporting Kansas City player. The wow. flag was up anyway. Just a few mistakes towards the end, I think, of Costas. But it, we're, we're confident. Like, regardless of whatever happens, the seed the seedings are whatever they are, but as soon as it's playoffs, anything can happen. I think we showed that on Thursday, and hopefully we do the same again on Sunday. And I think we went out there, we tried to give everything we could, and the fans were right behind us. And, you know, in the end, it nearly made a massive difference because I think we deserve to have gotten more out of the game, but I suppose that's the way football works. It's halftime right now. It's, it's halftime. Um, I will say I'll give my guys a lot of credit because I mean they were they were a little tired let's be honest you know uh, and Kansas City is top of the list for a reason it's not really much to talk about we're without Albert so now we have to make an adjustment um, and wh whoever that we insert not only in that position but the extra position that's available you know has a job to do so we have uh, we have seven days probably they're gonna be at home they're gonna push the play a little bit more they might have a more ball possession like we did at home tonight you know which is which is all it's all good but uh at the end of the day at this point it's, it's about results you know it's not about how you play it's not about how many shots on goal you have you know we had two shots on goal in lafc and we scored three goals so it's going to take the same kind of effort and uh, as I said, we're going, to, we're going to need to score at least a couple of goals, you know.